The LPS Marcus channel and its videos are rated PG-13. Videos as of 2020 contain mature themes, mature humor, and things not suitable for a young audience. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hey everyone, me LPS Marcus here, back for another video, and today, it's a big box here. Marcus, it says eBay on it. It is an LPS from eBay haul. Well, kind of. These are pets from eBay, so technically yes. But this is kind of going into my series of uh, hauls that I've done, like LPS from France haul, LPS from Poland haul. The latest installment of this is the LPS from Germany haul. Because I got a nice package from Germany, and uh, we got some pretty good LPS in it at a pretty good price. So let's open it then. I wish I could make this video more interesting and tell you guys about going to Germany in real life. Because that would have been part of my school's Europe trip last year if we had one. I was going to go on my Europe trip in my final year of high school. But unfortunately, things didn't pan out, and well, essentially, COVID happened, so the past two Europe trips got canceled. I wasn't going to go on 2021 anyways. Thank God I didn't, because if that trip ended up happening, can you imagine? I mean, people would be stuck in the countries probably, because I was supposed to be in, like, mid-March, right when things went to crap. There was no Europe trip that year. Uh, there was no Europe trip in 2021 for my school. I do want to travel again. Not this year, I'd say, but definitely next year in 2022, because... My brother is graduating from college. I'll be halfway through university, but more so my brother's graduating from college in April of next year. And just to travel with him somewhere for like a week, that would be really nice. So. And maybe even LPS con someday, not this year. Cause it's, I don't know. I'm almost anxious thinking that far about the future. Like some people, I don't know. I'll, I don't want to go too on about school. We're here to open this package, not go on about how COVID ruined what I was going to do and ruined a lot of my plans. I'm just trying to cut this package open right quick though. So here, I'll just come back when it's fully opened. So the package is open guys, and oh my god, this is like a blind bag, holy crap. Like they put it in a box and then I got a whole, whole blind bag here to open. So, let's do that. You guys can probably see it now. Oh, it sucks the package, hold on a sec. Now I'll stump these out and look them one by one. Starting off, we got a free Teensy. Pretty sweet, but um, a great way, I guess a cute way to open up this haul, because I actually like this Teensy, but I don't really use the Teensies for much, nor do I have a big interest for them, but still, much appreciated that the seller put a free one in there, along with my order. Pretty cool, but let's get to the big pets. You guys can get your focus off all the big five pets in the background for a second. You would notice this fish here. You're probably looking at the big fives in the background that we'll get to in a minute, don't worry. But I love the LPS Angel Fish. I always want to get more from my collection. I don't know, it was just, one of the first pets I ever got was an angel fish, and I just fell in love with them. I really love fish, and I like this one, there's some glitter on it, it was one of the later European pets, They're like European exclusive ones, I believe a lot of the later Hasbro ones were only released in Europe, or, or so I read, but I'm not 100% sure about that. But I like this, a nice blue, orange, yellow, kind of makes me think of like, kind of like citrus, like, you know what Five Alive is, like Five Alive, it's like this fruit juice, kind of looks like a Five Alive, the same color scheme sort of, is what I'm getting at. But either way, I'm not going to ramble on about that. Pretty cool to have this one, and I'm pretty happy. This is the next one I got here. If you ever think, I, I don't remember who made it. I don't know if it was my LPS Pet World. I forget who. I'm sorry, I don't remember this. But someone made a LPS parody of the TV show Jesse. And this pet was always used as Jesse, and I can see why. Pretty cool Cocker Spaniel, one of the earlier ones. Not really one of my favorites, but when I think of classic LPS tube videos, and I think of the Jesse parodies, I'm sorry, I can't remember. I have a foggy memory of who made it. But, um, yes, yeah, search it up for yourself. Just classic LPS tube history right there. And, uh, well, this pet associated with that very much. I'm very happy to have it in the collection. So let's move on to the next pet. Next up here is the LPS Advent Calendar Short Hair Cat. It is authentic. And this one sometimes sells for high, but I've seen it at low prices before. I got a pretty good price on it, so I'm very happy to have it. Uh, you see the hexagon there. No magnets. It is one of the later um, old LPS. But I do really like this one a lot. I like the pattern. I like the design. And, uh... Yeah, like, it's not too funky, too crazy looking, but it's got a very unique design to it, and I just really like it a lot. So I'm so happy to have this one. See the great things laying in the background, but before we get to them, this is probably the most expensive pet out of the haul. I paid around 40 bucks for it, but I see it go from 80 to 90 bucks, sometimes 70 if you get lucky. But it is a rare dachshund. It came with one of the playsets back in the day. Like, it's one of the later pets, but it's hard to find. I see it go for crazy prices, which I don't know why. It's not, like, the best-looking pet. Don't get me wrong, though. 
just the whole scarcity of it and the unique design on this pet i really really like it i don't know what those patterns on the ears are supposed to be or what they were going for with this one but it's very cool and it's a very unique less basic looking dachshund and for a pretty rare pet to get in this haul i'm very happy to have it next up i took off the accessories it's literally snowy's pet shop's mascot snowy of course what can i say about him very talented guy makes some great lps music videos great member of the community and a uh, pretty popular male LPS tuber, and when you're a male LPS tuber like myself, pretty cool to have other ones to look up to. I know I don't make the most music videos, but here and there I'll post one every now and again. But uh, anyways, pretty cool, happy to have this one. And the stars on the eyes just make this one so cool. And how can you not think of Snowy's Pet Shop when you see it? Next up, this one I think it came with like a fashion runway playset. It came with a bigger playset back in the day. This is like a more feminine Great Dane. You don't see a lot of super feminine ones like this, but this is a pretty cool one because most of the Great Danes used in videos are represented as masculine, but this one kind of breaks that gender barrier. I mean, you can use any pet you want and have it masculine or feminine, but uh, what I'm just saying is in terms of what people go for in a video, this is kind of the rare, more feminine Great Dane that you see. So it's pretty cool to see Hasbro do that, venture off and do that with this pet. And it just, I'm just pretty happy to have this one. Not my favorite Great Dane, but I love this one. I love the blue eyes. I love the pink colors, and uh, that's all I can say about it. Let's move on to the next pet. The final Dane we have... <laughs> yeah, not the greatest condition. Okay, but this is better than a lot of ones I've seen, okay? It's like the person who owned this as a kid, they colored up there, and they were like, ah, uh, damn, and they just gave up. You can see they weren't the greatest at coloring, but I, I thank that person for their... Uh, horrible coloring skills on this one or maybe they colored it and regretted it. i really don't know i'm not here to insult whoever previously owned this another great dane that people use this one more as a feminine one but i've seen it used masculinely as well when i think of this one i think of uh someone made a music video for the song timber you know that song it's a classic by pitbull classic of my childhood and someone used this pez pitbull it had shades on so that's all i can think of when i i see this lps that's really all i can think of by the way happy to have it in the collection and uh well, that caps off the haul. With that being said, guys, this has been the LPS from Germany haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this latest haul. I'll see you guys next week in the next video. Peace out. Peace.